Blake Sloan here, Sloan Roser Group. Got a brand new awesome success story here with Daniel Sorber. Uh, Dan just finished up his first 90 day challenge here with us um, as a new agent here with our company. You had a previous company before you came with us, right? Right, yep. And just uh, finished up 90 day challenge and transform almost every part of your life, right? Yeah. Oh, every part, every part. I mean, I really am making steps uh, in toward uh, like having it all, really. You know and, what I mean? And you, yeah. like a whole different person. The person that was here 90 days ago. I, it was a different person. It really person. was. Yeah, physically, was mentally, business-wise, right? Business-wise, my relationship with my wife and my kids has improved, and I just really, I couldn't ask for more. It's, and let's break those down. So like Dan started at uh, well, January 1st, right? It was part of your first challenge. So we started the challenge. And then you were, weight-wise, you lost 30 pounds. I, w I was at 270 pounds. Uh, my goal was 240 by the end of the 30 days. And 90 days. Oh, I'm sorry, 90 days. That's right, the 90 days. And, uh, I, you know, I, honestly, that was a goal that scared me because I didn't think if I was going to really be able to make that big of a weight loss. But I, but I did. I and you smashed it, it, right? I, I got, actually, it was 239. It was, it was 239 and 238 was my final And you changed weight. all parts yeah. of your life, right? You're working out energy-wise, health-wise. You said you felt Absolutely. older, uh, better. I have energy, you know, uh, to take on any challenge that, that comes at me every day. And what happened to your certainty and your confidence and stuff as you kind of went through that and saw the transformation? Oh, it skyrocketed. Like, I, I don't get stressed as easily now, and it's just I take everything in stride. It's just, and and what you see kind of the coolest part for me, and I've seen this actually happen online too, watch the, the transformation in, in your marriage yeah. with your, your wife and your kids and stuff, because you started leading by example doing these changes. Right. Yes, and then what, what, tell everybody about what happened after that. Oh, well, you know, she really, uh, you know, she saw how hard I was working to lose weight. You know, I was working out four to five days a week, and I was really watching my diet and everything. And, you know, she, uh, a few weeks back, jumped on it, and she's been going to the gym herself, watching her diet, and she's like, she's outclassing me now. So yeah. now, I need, now I need to step my game back up to kind of match what she's doing. But she's just, she took it and ran with it, and she's been so supportive. And, and what do you think way. have, you know, what do you think has done to your marriage as a whole? With all the, not just the working out, but all the changes from, from reading and stuff we do and the study and all the, the principles that we base our, you know, business and life on. What do you think that's really done to your marriage? It's, it's on fire right now is the best way I can describe it. Um, you know, we're, we communicate better. Uh, we're more understanding of each other. We're more open and the communication's a lot better. And that's really what it's all about is just being open and communicating and we can, Feel like we could take on any challenge that comes. Yeah, it's across. awesome, right? It makes yeah. you feel like you're a powerful, powerful dude with it. Oh, them, absolutely, right? yeah. And the same thing with, with spiritual, same thing with your kids, right? We had certain goals that Dan set uh, for nine days: certain date nights with your kids, yep. certain date nights with your wife, yes, and uh, certain family nights. Yep. And you said that really kind of helped everybody, you know, even plan a trip to what Disney you're kind of doing. Yep, yep. We're gonna be going to Disney uh, in June, uh, so we have that all planned out. But and uh, then also, you smashed your business goals just last month. Put six under contract. Yes, yep. So that and that he said certain goals, so we smashed all four areas of life, which we have body, um, being with spirituality, uh, balance with relationships, and then business as a whole, right? And so looking at the the whole transformation you saw nine days ago where you started, and I've seen it online and how you post, mm -hmm. how you talk, how you operate, how you dress, everything we've seen a huge transformation on. Yeah, and absolutely. I'm excited to kind of see where that goes. I mean, based on kind of where you're out there, anybody out there is kind of, you know, maybe you know, looking for the right opportunity or just, you know, does it feel like they've had the right tools? You know, what would you say to anybody out there who, who doesn't have it all in line? They could be having a lot of business but having the lacking other areas of life, right? Or, you know, they, they want to be able to have all four areas. What would you say to anybody out there in regards to what our systems and our, our tools and our processes do? Uh, you know, you got to set small goals and you got to set something that you can measure. Uh, so it's just about, you don't want to have to swing for that home run every day. You want to hit those singles every single day. You want to have something that you can measure. You want to print these goals out. I mean, you print out like 20 of them, leave them all over the yeah, house. Yeah, which what we do. Reminded. And for anybody out there, we set, we set our 90 day goals. We live life in 90 day challenges pretty much. Yeah. And then we set all four areas and have a very simple one page goal sheet that everyone goes through. And it's not like nothing fanatical. I mean, even with the changes in your, in your, your physicality, mm -hmm. it's like you, you just worked out and ate better, right? But it's really cool how they're connected where you start working out then you don't want to eat as bad and it kind of fixes the other part, right? Right, absolutely. We also had that mud run planned. Right, that's right. I didn't, you know, want, I didn't want to be in over my head. When rugged maniac. Right? So yeah, yeah, the rugged maniac that we had done. So I wanted to make sure that I had the energy and, and, and at least a base level physicality in order to get through that. So it was, it definitely, it, it upped the bar. It was better than just saying, oh, I got to lose 20 pounds. Because right. now it's- There's like, a bigger reason why. There's a bigger reason. You have you have more of a why. And that's something we do focus on. Like a lot of us did Spartan races, some of us are doing Go Rug. 
um, different things that really kind of push you beyond that, that mm -hmm. measure of doing that. You know, what would you also say about culture, you know, in regards to how everybody helps each other and kind of the pushing each other and things like that? The culture here is phenomenal. I, it just was not what I was expecting when I first started working here. I mean, you know, during the initial interviews, you had talked about the core four and, and these, setting these goals and everything. It was not what I had expected, and everybody is so supportive, and everybody is there ready and willing to lend a hand and to push you toward those goals and help hold you accountable for yep. too. You know, and it's and it's it's done a lot for my life. It's really been a one eighty as far as definitely man. I, I just wanted to congratulate you publicly. Thank you. Like I said, you've been Appreciate crushing it. it. You got a huge future in this. Yes. And uh, anybody out there, you know, looking to to find more fulfillment in life or more balance in life or you know, like I said, you could be somebody who who's has a lot of talent but just not be able to find the right opportunity in business or crushing a lot of business and you're missing other parts of life like Dan talked about our goal here is to have it all, right? Not just Absolutely. not just kill yourself working, you know, 80 hours a week in real estate, having money, nothing else. You want to have your relationship with your wife or your husband if you're a female, obviously, your children to be a great father or mother and to be able to build a, a real life, not just a, a certain business, whatever it may be. Yeah. And it's something that's long term. So to have that balance. So, you know, they all enforce each other. So when your home life is, is going really well, you come to work and you crush it every day. It's easy. And I'm really enthusiastic about working here, being able to come and work every day and just to see what challenges can I overcome today. Cool, man. Well, I appreciate you. Anybody out there, you know, looking to all level up, click the button here, or reply back to us, and we can set up a one-on-one -on -one consultation.